This is an asymmetrical inversion breathing exercise, grabbing a small thin block. If you sometimes struggle in a typical inversion or all fours position, you feel that expansion and the neck kicks on, sometimes doing it offset or one side at a time can be really helpful. So I'm placing this thin block underneath my left knee. It's gonna hang there so I get a nice stretch in the left glute. I'm gonna allow my right knee to shift long. I'm gonna come down onto my left forearm and kind of keep my right hand here. So I kind of have this almost twist in my spine and um, I have most of my pressure on my left side, pushing actively through my left hand. I'm gonna think about watching that I don't get too much into my neck on that right side, but I'm just kind of creating this stretch and rotation. I'm gonna inhale, exhale, keeping that kind of shift over to the left side, inhale, exhale. So maybe you hang here for about five, six breaths, and then you can switch. Keeping that block underneath the left side, I'm gonna to go to the right, right arm down, left hand just rests. Keeping my hips kind of over that left side, I'm gonna kind of push actively through that right hand. Exhale, let it go. Pull back is relaxed, inhale. Exhale, let it go. So see how it feels side to side. Maybe one side, it feels a little bit easier to get that airflow. I know for me, it's when my right arm is down. So from the side, still have the block underneath that left knee, left arm is gonna come down and I'm in that kind of inverted position. And then when I switch, I'm gonna keep the block under the left knee, right arm down and breathe. So I'm creating this sort of twist in the spine. Just getting the ribs moving, and then we can also focus on getting the pelvis moving.